Welcome to my YouTube channel Learn with Zola Norin. Today, we will learn how to make security door lock with Arduino using Tinkercad. Create a new project on Tinkercad. Search the components which we are going to use in this project and drag them to blank space. We will select the small breadboard for the 16 cross 2 LCD connections. Then we will add servo motor. We will add mini breadboard for the RGB light. We will search the RGB light in the search box and will place it on the mini board. Now, it's time to place the 16 cross 2 LCD display. Search the potentiometer and drag it to small breadboard. It's time to connect the all components. Short the positive terminal of breadboard with other positive terminal. Short the ground terminal of the breadboard with the other terminal. Connect the Arduino 5V with the positive terminal of the breadboard. Connect the Arduino ground with the negative terminal of the breadboard. Connect the potentiometer left terminal with the positive terminal of the breadboard. Connect the potentiometer right terminal with the negative terminal of the breadboard. Connect the potentiometer viper terminal with the contrast pin of LCD. Connect the ground terminal of servo with the negative terminal of breadboard. Connect the power pin of servo with the positive terminal of breadboard. Connect the signal pin of servo with the digital pin 6 of Arduino. Connect the red pin of RGB LED with D11 of Arduino. Place 1 kilo ohm resistance between the cathode pin of RGB LED and ground of Arduino. Connect the blue pin of RGB LED with D10 of Arduino. Connect the green pin of RGB LED with D9 of Arduino. Short the LCD ground with the breadboard ground. Short the LCD power terminal with the breadboard positive terminal. Connect the LCD register pin with D8 of Arduino. Ground the read-write pin of LCD with the breadboard.
Connect the LCD enable pin with D7 of Arduino. Connect the DB4 pin with D5 of Arduino. Connect the DB5 pin with D4 of Arduino. Connect the DB6 pin with D3 pin of Arduino. Connect the DB7 pin with D2 pin of Arduino. Place 1 kilo ohm resistance between the LCD anode and the positive terminal of breadboard. Connect the LCD cathode with the ground terminal of breadboard. It's time to connect the keypad with Arduino. Connect the row 1 of keypad with the A0 of Arduino. Connect the row 2 of keypad with the A1 of Arduino. Connect the row 3 of keypad with the A2 of Arduino. Connect the row 4 of keypad with the A3 of Arduino. Connect the column 1 of keypad with the A4 of Arduino. Connect the column 2 of keypad with the A5 of Arduino. Connect the column 3 of keypad with the D1 pin of Arduino. Connect the column 4 of keypad with the D0 pin of Arduino. Click on the code button and change it into text form. Paste the code mentioned in the description and press the button Start Simulation. Enhance the contrast of LCD. Enter the password. For example our password is 1234567. After enter the password press the hash button to match it. And door will open. If we enter a wrong password a red LED will blink and access denied will print on the LCD. One can also clear the password by pressing star button if he have entered wrong password mistakenly.